Welcome to this video where you get to test yourself to see how well you know the lungs and gas exchange topic for your GCSE exams. Hopefully you've had a chance to watch the revision lesson video on the lungs and gas exchange. The idea with this is it's multiple choice. Answer the question with the one that you think is the best possible response. Good luck, off we go. Question number one. Name the structure labeled in the diagram below. Is it the trachea? Is it the alveoli? Is it the bronchus? Or is it the diaphragm? answer is the diaphragm. Question number two. The structures below are where gases get exchanged in the lungs. What are they called? Are they the alveoli? Are they the bronchus? Are they the trachea? Or is it the diaphragm? The answer is the alveoli. Question number three. Name the structure labeled below. Is it the bronchi? Is it the trachea? Is it the bronchioles? Or is it the alveoli? The correct answer is the trick here. Question four. Which of these is not an adaptation of the alveoli? Thick muscular walls. Large surface area. Good supply from the capillaries. The correct answer is thick muscular walls. Question number five. The supply of air to the alveoli in the lungs is known as, is it respiration, diffusion, or ventilation? The correct answer is ventilation. Question number six. Oxygen and carbon dioxide move into and out of the blood by, is it osmosis, act of transport, or diffusion? The correct answer is diffusion.
Question 7. The table below shows how the air inhaled and the air exhaled differs. Which of the gases is oxygen? Is it gas A or gas B? The correct answer is gas A. Question 8. Oxygen is transported to the cells of the body by the blood. Where in the cell does respiration occur? Is it the nucleus? Is it the mitochondria? Is it the cytoplasm? Or is it the cell membrane? The correct answer is the mitochondria. Question number nine. Other than oxygen and carbon dioxide, what does exhaled air contain more of than inhaled air? Is it nitrogen? Is it methane? Or is it water vapor? The correct answer is water vapour. And finally, question 10. Alveoli are surrounded by capillaries which provide a good blood supply. How are the capillaries adapted to allow for rapid diffusion of oxygen and carbon dioxide? Are the walls one cell thick? Do they have valves or are they wide? The correct answer is the walls are one cell thick. Well done for completing this test. Hopefully you did well. If you did struggle with it, I'd suggest you go back and have a look at the video lesson. I'll put the link above uh, or try another video. Have a great day.